everyone, welcome back to Trina's Humble Homestead. Did you know that a blend of essential oils could be your secret defense against the seasonal sniffles? Today we are diving into the world of essential oils and making a blend called Thieve Oil also known as mercy oil and how it can supercharge your immune health if you're ready to learn how to make it and discover its health benefits then stick around first off exactly what is thieve oil this incredible blend is inspired by a historical legend of thieves who used a mix of essential oils to protect themselves against the plague the blend typically includes clove oil, lemon, cinnamon, eucalyptus, and rosemary. Together, these oils create a very potent formula that's known for its immune boosting properties. Now, let's talk about the benefits of Thieves Oil. Its ability to support immune health. The antibacterial and antiviral properties of the oils are what help strengthen the immune system. Also promotes respiratory health. Eucalyptus and rosemary can help clear the airway and help support respiratory function. Sometimes, if I'm feeling congested, I use eucalyptus many times in my decongestant apple cider vinegar steam. I do have a video on that. Or sometimes I'll just put a, dot, a couple dot drops in my shower and just let it steam in there, and that helps. So eucalyptus is a really good one. So I'm excited to use this one with the rosemary. This also can be a mood enhancer. The aromatic properties can uplift your spirit and help reduce stress. I know that this is true too. I know sometimes I'll just go out to my herb garden and smell some lemongrass or smell some things and it's just, oh, it just calms me down. So this is a great way to use natural resources to help as mood enhancers. It's a, also a fantastic natural cleaner, making it great for your home. I always use some essential oils in my natural cleaners as well. So knowing that this is also one that would be a great blend with my cleaners is exciting. So how do we make thieves oil? Are you ready to make your own thieves oil? I recently had somebody reach out to me and ask if I would make her some thieves oil. She said, since I have all of the oils, would I make it for her? And um, I, ha I happily obliged. So I'm going to make it for her. I'm actually going to make it in a jar here because I'm going to make a triple batch. I'm going to make one for myself and then she wants two. So I'm going to do it in this jar. And then I have these little blue Jar, dropper jars here. So this is what I'm going to store them in. I'll label them and then I will send her her two and then I will have my own thieves or mercy oil and I'm going to start using it especially now that when the fall comes and it's just to, to help protect protect during these these uh you know these little times you know <laughs> these little times where cold and flu season is upon us so the first thing we're gonna do is we do and I'm gonna give you the recipe for one for one um, recipe but I once again I'm gonna triple it in here so what we do is we do 10 drops of clove oil Oops, so I'm going to take the top off and I'm going to use a dropper. So I'm going to do 30 drops. So that's about a whole dropper. It's about 30 drops. So, so that's the clove oil. So we're going to use 10 drops of each of these. So next we're going to use the lemon essential oil. Need a little bit more of this. Mm, 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 mm. 
so good. Okay. And then we will do 10 drops of the cinnamon essential oil, which once again, I'm going to do 30. Okay. Then 10 drops of eucalyptus oil. I don't know if this one is open. Let me find one that's open. Here I have an open eucalyptus. So let's... So we got 30 drops of that. And 10 drops of the rosemary. Okay. Now. Mm, smells really good, you guys. Mm, I smell, really smell the eucalyptus in there. Then we are going to add two tablespoons of a carrier oil. Now you can use like a jojoba oil or a coconut oil. I, of course, am going to use castor oil because castor oil penetrates so much deeper and it's good for so many things. So this is what I'm going to use. And it says, it says to use two tablespoons, so I'm going to use six. Two, three four, five, six. So there we go. We got six tablespoons here. And I'm just going to mix it up. Oh yes, I smell it. It's amazing. It smells amazing. Okay. And then I'm going to go get a funnel and I'm going to put it in my jars. And there you have it. Your very own thieves oil. It's just that easy. Just remember to store it in a cool, dark place. You want to use some dark, darker bottles. Glass is always best, and it helps preserve its potency. Now that we've made the thieves oil, how do we use it? So number one, we can use it as a topical application. We can apply just a few drops to our, our wrist, our neck, and also as a detoxification, we could put it on the soles of our feet. Now, I like to do this at night on the soles of my feet. I know sometimes if I feel a little like a coldish or a little congested, I'll put it on the soles of my feet and then I'll put some socks on and it kind of helps keep that in. So that works really good. As a diffusion, we can put some, some drops of the oil in our diffuser and just let it purify our air and helps also with our breathing and things. I've always used eucalyptus oil in my diffuser, so this is a great one to use in the diffuser. For cleaning, we can mix a few drops with water and vinegar and just use it as an all-purpose spray. So that is another one. When I make my disinfectant cleaner, I use just a little bit of rubbing alcohol with some vinegar and some unchlorinated water, and that's an amazing cleaner. So that's another way um, to use it. We can use it as a cleaner. And as an as inhalation. So I can just smell it and it just, oh, I just love the, the way things smell. I love it when my house smells good. So just boosting your mood. It is a great way to use it as inhalation. You can just open the bottle and just kind of Oh, if you just need a little pick-me-up. So that's another great way to use it. So these are great ways to incorporate natural healing into your life. Super simple. And it just promotes wellness, which is what we're trying to do. Promote wellness, easy, non-expensive ways to use natural alternatives into our everyday life. And let's go over why do we use the thieves oil? So thieves oil does boost immune health, which is super important, right? With the seasons coming up here, we want it in our kids going back to school, uh, you know, just all the little germy germs that are going around. It's just a great way to boost that immune health. Another defense mechanism, why not, right? It's not harmful and it's a great way to just 
have another layer of protection. The combination of these essential oils, they have been shown to have antimicrobial properties which do help protect against different illnesses. Plus the antioxidants that are in these oils just help overall wellness. So it just makes it a fantastic addition to your daily routine. And I am all about adding anything easy and simple into my life to help boost my immunity, my health journey, and that is why I wanted to share this with you as well. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Trina's Humble Homestead for more amazing tips on natural health and wellness. Have you tried making thieves oil before? Do you call it thieves oil or mercy oil? I've known it as thieves oil, but um, my friend asked me to make mercy oil, so I had to kind of look it up and be like, mercy oil? And I was like, oh, hey, I know what that is. So what do you call it and have you tried to make it? Let me know in the comments below or any other oil blends that you use for natural wellness. I would love to know. Trying to incorporate more of these kinds of things into my, into my daily routine as well. Or if you have any questions, also leave those in the comments. I'm, I'm happy to answer those. And remember that sharing is caring. So share this video with your friends so that they can also reap from the benefits of simple, natural medicine and health. Let's try to boost all of our immune systems and live a healthy life. Thanks for watching everyone. Stay healthy and I will see you in the next video. Be blessed and don't forget you're loved. Bye!